doesn't look good in the background. Can't have it. <laughs> you can't even see Yo, guys, what's up? This is Daisy. And right now, I'm playing some MW2, and I'm going to be telling you guys a story. And right now, i got my friend in the background. It's a moderation. Hi. Go check him out. He'll be in the description. But anyways, let's get into this video. So, this story is going to be about going to the principal's office two times in one day. Yeah, I know. Two times in one day. You're like, Tazy, how could you do that? I, do I don't know, dude. I don't know. Anyways, guys, Black Ops 3 got born, so I decided to play some MW2. Just throwing it back to some old Call of Duty, because MW2 is just awesome, dude. And I just love that kill. So this was up. We have two portables and a school. The two portables are the grade 8 classes and they're like outside of the school. So they're not too far out but they're far enough out. And there's three portables in total but the two that I'm talking about are the grade 8 ones. They're like far near the field area. And then the other portable is just like grade 4 and up. Yeah, we have a small school. Is my disc getting chewed up in there? So it was about three weeks ago and it was snowing out. It was all icy and all that. And we have like a rule. We can't touch each other, we can't slide on ice, we can't throw snowballs, it's a pretty gay school. So me and my friends, the idiots that we are, we go out there and we go behind the portable. And since the teachers can't see us, they throw a little fit when we're behind there. Plus, we're sliding on ice and we're throwing snowballs at each other. So therefore, they freak out. This one teacher, I'm not going to say his name, but he is the meanest teacher ever. He's like the definition of the Grinch. This guy, he's is, is just so pathetic. He's a grade 7 teacher, and he's like, he's the meanest teacher ever. Like, he's the meanest teacher ever. Like, honestly, he is the strictest teacher too. Like, it's, it's so pathetic. It's pathetic. It really is. And so, we get caught back there, and he's like, okay, you guys are going to the principal's office. So we go, no biggie. My friend's like, oh no, I'm going to get a responsibility. Dude. I've been here two times in one day. And it, it was my first time. I'm like, oh, what you do? I was throwing snowballs. I'm like, oh, yeah, nice. So we go there, and they just sit us on the bench, like in front of the office, just normal things. So we're there, just sitting on the bench, and the principal comes out, and the teacher comes out. And the teacher is like, oh, um, tell the principal what you're doing. He's like the vice principal. That's why we hate him. He's just so mean. And we're like, oh, we're just sliding on ice, uh, having fun. And she's like, okay, whatever. And she walks out the door and goes gets lunch. And then the other teacher, the one that called us out and bring us to the office, he goes out to lunch too. And so we're just sitting there on the bench for at least one hour and nothing happened. So we decided to leave lunch so that's why we left because we were hungry so we left to go have lunch then we did our extra two periods of math which i hate and we have recess again and me being the idiot i am it was totally my fault my friends shouldn't have been in trouble on this one i i say okay guys let's do it let's go one more time and the teacher wasn't out on duty the one that caught us the first time but he's a, he just spies on us he, he's he's such a freak he spies on us right like we do nothing and he spies on us playing soccer across the schoolyard you see him staring at us the guy's a freak but anyways this teacher decides to go to our classroom to tell our teacher because our teacher didn't know about it yet and we're behind our portable so while he's walking to go to our portable he sees us behind there and there's like a crate like a, a crate full of like desks and all that it's a big crate so my friends like I thought I saw the teacher and I'm like my heart stopped I'm like you're joking because we joke like that a lot. And he's like, no, I'm not joking. So he comes behind the crate and says, Jonathan, go to the office. And he didn't see me at the time. So I, I pretend I was playing with the grade twos, a soccer game. And the worst decision I ever made. He's like, Dylan, you two get to the office. And I'm like, oh. so we're walking to the office. And at the time, my other friend was behind there too. Like the first time we got caught, he just said he was not behind there. He said he was beside it. So he believed that, of course. And... So we're going to the office, and the friend that was behind us there with us, he runs up to me. I'm like, oh, you got in trouble this time? He's like, yeah, the teacher walked up to me. He's like, you can admit it this time? And, of course, my friend admitted it. So three of us are going to the office. So it's my second time. My other friend is the third time. And my other friend that didn't get caught the first time, that's his first time. So, therefore, that's... That's seven times people been to the principal's office. Oh my god. So we, all three of us go to the office and we're scared. We're really scared. We're like, oh no. So the principal takes us in and she was mad. She was mad this time. She was really mad. She's like, what do you guys think you're doing? You don't care when we talk and all that. We're like, you left last time. Well, we didn't say that, but we're going to say that. But then she's giving us a whole rant about how we don't respect her and how we shouldn't be grade 8s and we're immature and the grade 2s are mature than us and we think that that's true that's true so then she's like okay um what should i do what's gonna be your consequence 
And we go to this trip, and we're going to a camp. Like, it's a real cool camp. And she's like, oh, I'm going to take it out away from you guys. We're like, really? And she's going to take away Canada's Wonderland for us. We're like, really? So she's like, okay, I'm not going to take it away unless you don't go behind there one more time. Like, if I catch you one more time, you're getting cut off. Like, there's no more. And we're like, okay, okay, okay. And then the final period, I'm like, let's go behind there. But we didn't. My friends stopped me. Thank God. So, that's pretty much the end of the story. Like, it's kind of pathetic. I, like, never told anyone other than my friends too much. Like, that's pretty much it. Like, I didn't really make a video about it ever. So, I decided to make a video because I thought it'd be a good story to tell. So, guys, before this video ends, I just want to say I was going to record a World at War custom zombies maps because I had uh, this mario one i had the saloon one and this Eller cheese one it was really cool but every time i record with the obs my computer lags like big time my frame rate drops like heavy so it looks really bad so hopefully i'm going to be getting a new computer soon but i'm going to make a lot of videos like counter strike videos because i love opening cases and playing that game it's just amazing but i hope you guys like the video please like subscribe and comment and as always guys it's my and uh peace <laughs>